chase it, no problem. And I don't like, dislike more goldies or long tails. Got him. What a fish. Good work, son. As anglers, we really have so much modern technology available to us. From the mapping systems, GPS systems, and sonar systems we have in our boat that help us catch fish, we also have mobile applications like this sort of thing here that can allow us to check up-to-date information on the weather before we go on a trip, and while we're on the trip as well, to make sure that we're fishing under safe conditions. Now let's have a look at a few of these different modern applications and how we can use them to benefit our fishing, but also make sure we have a safe fishing trip as well. Having a look around on the net, there is just so much information available to boaties and anglers alike. And the perfect example of that is Google Maps or Google Earth. Now basically what it is, is a satellite view that you can zoom around and look at individual areas. To make things easier, we've gathered all these links and put them on one page on our website for you. So this is Google Maps. What you can do is double click on the map to enlarge the image. Or you can use this handy slider to zoom in and out. You can also type in your destination in the box and then click search maps. And here we have Wyala in South Australia where we filmed a really great snapper story. Now if you own a large trailer boat, you can see that there will be absolutely no problems launching it here. Or if you're more adventurous angler, you can have a look at creek systems way out west and find bridge access, roads that may access it, all in the comfort of your lounge room. It's a really incredible but very, very important tool for people that like to get out on the water but have a good idea of where they're going before they actually go there. Okay, so let's go to Sydney and I'll show you another handy feature. What you can do is drag the yellow person icon down onto the map and have a look at the street view. Now keep in mind that this feature may not be available on every map. You can use the tools to zoom in and take a closer look. Do you recognise that boat? Starlo certainly does. Even with the help of Google Maps, you still have to catch the fish yourself. Another great thing about the internet is the access you can get to weather forecasting sites. But weather forecasting sites that are specifically designed with anglers and boaties in mind. Now I'm sure if you own a boat and you're heading offshore, you realise how important it is to get that weather just right. A lot of these sites are specifically geared right down to specific areas. You can pick your local area and you can see the tides that are upcoming, the wind direction, the size of the swell, and forecast for the next four days. So it can give you a pretty good picture on what sort of conditions you're expecting to face should you go out offshore. And did you know that surf cameras are also available in certain areas? What you can do is see live footage of beaches and bar crossings well and truly before you hitch the boat to the back of the car. Always remember to check the weather forecast first and always inform the Coast Guard of your plans for the day's fishing. The Coast Guard can always give you more detailed information. When we're travelling around Australia for the fishing DVD, we need to be really aware of local rules, regulations and changes to bag limits and the internet is a fantastic tool for finding out that information. As anglers, it's our responsibility to know those rules when we go to a new area. I'll just have a quick look at what's happening up in the Northern Territory. Here we go, a handy reference to the regulations for recreational fishing in the Northern Territory download. Bag limits and legal sizes with special notes on certain areas just like the Mary River. No fish zones and more information on species identification. This can all be downloaded and printed to take with you while you're on the water. Now another great thing about the internet is you can buy all your fishing licenses and permits online so they're current and up to date. And don't forget to check out the Fishing DVD website. It's a fantastic website and we've got some really great competitions with some fantastic prizes from Dyla. And you can also upload some photos of yourself so we can see what you're catching out there as well. 